first of all, you can use any photograph like this one of an old tree trunk. Follow the techniques outlined in this video and you can place a green screen image moving around anywhere in the photograph. This process uses the free VSDC editor and a graphics editor. And if you don't have a graphics editor, the free GIMP, G-I-M-P graphics editor is perfect as it won't cost you a penny to create this exceptional production technique. Today we live in a digital age where people spend a significant amount of their time Select your image to place your green screen image into. First step is to size the original image to the video format and save it, preferably as a PNG or ping file. Make sure that the image is standard size of 1920 pixels by 1080 pixels. Then open the saved image. I use the free GIMP program to accomplish the outlining and once outlined copy it and then pasting it as a new image. Then exporting this new image as a PNG file to the same folder. Then I also exported the original scene to the same folder and also as a pink file. Now open the VSDC editor and place the background image on the editor. Next, place your green screen image that you want to use on the editor and remove the green screen background making it transparent. Now move it to the right of the screen and click on the scene in the timeline and then on the original background until the scene is highlighted. Now open and add your separated scene and place it on top and position it. Remember, always hold down the shift key if you have to resize this image and you can position the highlighted image using the arrow keys and preview it for exact positioning. When it is in the exact position, move your green screen object back onto the editor and presto, you can position the image according to size and location. You are done. This opens the door for a lot of creative possibilities. I developed this unique technique that is ideal for placing a green screen action image inside a photograph. It can also be used in a variety of production scenes or it is great for titles and intros and endings. Thanks for watching and please subscribe.